Hello everyone, welcome back to Command Wolf Gaming, I'm CWG, and welcome back to Trailmakers. Now, if you take a look at this lovely jet here, it kind of looks like a Tomcat, because that's what I was trying, uh, trying to do here. And, um, it, it works pretty great, um, uh, but, uh, after finessing with it for a while, I feel like this is not what I'm looking for, especially for this style campaign. Now, uh, we are actually approaching the end, so we are pretty much at the end of this game right now, or at least the campaign for the game. So I want to make sure that I end out in the bang. Now, um, whoop, uh, now, as you can see, it is flying nicely, and that's not the issue here. It's just that it doesn't have the maneuverability that I'm looking for in uh, in it. It doesn't. It just doesn't have the maneuverability. <clears throat> because honestly, a lot of the targets that I'm facing right now, as you can see here, they're all sta stationary targets, right? So, I was thinking, I was like, you know what, what I could do? I can do my Corsair, but my Corsair, I really didn't set up to be a, um, you know, a bomber or a, f a fighter, uh, well, it is a fighter uh, plane, but it didn't have the ordinance to sustain what I would say a aerial fight. So, uh, what I did... Is I re-kitted out my Corsair. Now it is, uh, frankly, slower than my, uh, obviously, uh, Tomcat here. Uh, but I re-kitted it out quite a bit to actually have what the Tomcat had uh, with additional ordinances on air. So we actually got rockets equipped onto uh, my Corsair. Now, uh, not only that, I even went in armor-plated the main body. Now, I was actually fin uh, fix uh, fiddling around with the armor pieces, and I noticed that they do affect a uh, lift on your aircraft. So if you have an issue with flight, it's because the armor pieces are blocking the flaps uh, or uh, lift or wings or whatever pieces you have there. So that's why I kind I didn't armor up the wings. Uh, not that it would make much uh, sense to begin with. Maybe I can put like a little bit on there, but the uh, the ones I was using because I wanted as much coverage was not working well. So oh, okay, well we have to go over here anyway, <sighs> All right? And as you can see, this guy has. Oh God, no! <laughs> Fine. I was going to say, and uh, as we can see here, that uh, my Corsair actually does have a lot more maneuverability uh, in regards uh, to flight than my Tomcat did. Tomcat is great, but like even when I was engaging uh, enemy aircraft, which I was uh, testing out, was making adjustments to and everything, it really wasn't adding up to be uh, useful. Um, to be used, you know, so I was like, you know what, that's fine. We'll, we'll just go and we'll do, uh, we'll do the course. So, okay, let me go over here first because I see a power core here. And I think I got to go to this position. Hello, my wolf pack. Sorry to cut in on this video, but I wanted to bring to your attention that in the description section down below on this video, there will be a link to my Discord community channel, where not only will you join the wider community, but you will be given notifications of community nights and upload and live streams to YouTube, Odyssey, Rumble, and Kick. So come and join my CWG Discord community. Now, Back to the regularly scheduled programming. There we go. Fine, this is it. Thanks to all your efforts, we can now finally take the fight to the pirates. With the ancient weapon, we should be able to disable the shield. Then you can make short work of the pirate mothership. It will be easy as falling off a log. Hmm. Does anyone know how this weapon works? The legend doesn't tell. But I think we just have to assemble the pieces. Uh, 
Are you sure this works? According to my calculations... Wait! Something is happening. Oh no, it didn't work! Hold up, friends! Even though the shield didn't turn off, it looks like the shield generators are vulnerable. Destroy the shield generators and stable the shield. I can do that. There are four shield generators in total. Destroy all of them. But watch out. They are heavily uh, defended by the pirates. I don't see a problem with this. Okay, let's get to the course here. Now, I'm not using the bomber variant because it, I really wasn't having a good time with the bomber variant, honestly. So let me face this this way. I'm actually going to put... Uh, I forgot to do this before. Uh, I wanted to put these on. What are you going to do? Oh, wait. I got to do these one at a time, don't I? I'm going to put these on a toggle so I don't have to like constantly hold down spacebar. So. Okay, here we go. Perfect takeoff. Now again, I could use the Tomcat during this, but I would rather use uh, this. It just feels nicer in my hands. Oh god. Well, I didn't mean to do that. I also love the view uh, uh, with this cockpit. <laughs> I really wish there was a way I can lock the camera. Whoa, hello. Lock the camera. Uh, kind of makes sense. Okay. Little squirrel eat. Yeah, there we go. Another one bites dust. Da, da, da. Another one bites dust. Another one bites. Another one bites. Another one bites dust. Gotta lift up a little bit. Okay, two generators. Okay, okay. Whoop. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're still good. Ah! Takes a long time for the rockets to reload, and I wasted it. Oh god! It's fine. It's fine. <sighs> the thing is, loose left. Oh god! A terrible. A terrible takeoff. We got one more target. I think it's on the back side. And obviously we do actually have some points that we can grab here too. Okay, there we go. Come on. Okay, flaps engaged. I'm gonna slowly kind of work my way up here. 
Okay, here we are. We're at the peak. Or as far up uh, on the peak as we're gonna get. Oop. Ow, 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 ow. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. We're still good. Just go out. Gotta go out a little bit. Then we're gonna turn. There we go, there we go. <laughs> that was close. All right, let's just get on the ground. Kind of recuperate ourselves here. We might actually be able to get the little bit better with the Tomcat now. Now that we got kind of got more of a stationary target going on here. Yep, that's what I was scared of. Okay, here we are again. Okay, I think we got that one objective right there that's hanging off. Uh, there we go. That should be it. Yep, it is! Bye bye, mothership! Woo! We have beaten the mothership! You won! Yes, I did win. The pirates have been defeated, and things can finally return to normal. I bet they won't. Will not. We thank you enough, Trail. We can't thank you enough, Trail Maker. You are a living legend among the Tripos now. When you go back among the stars, know that you will always have a planet full of friends here. Hey, congratulations! The Turples have been saved. You can now return to Trailmakers HQ and report your success. But wait, Terry has a reward for you. A golden Chirpo trophy block. You completed the campaign in 17 hours and 5 minutes. You collected 35 out of 99 gold chests, uh, 45 out of 50 power cores, and 77 out of 82 blocks. I'm assuming the last bit of blocks I have are actually like near this area, so I kind of want to try to get those. Especially, uh, oop. hello. It was sitting on my head. Okay, let's get out of that view. All right. I know the campaign's done, but I still kind of want to grab these chests. I don't think it really would have any effect on the multiplayer, or not just the multiplayer, but also the, um, well, obviously the multiplayer if we do the campaign multiplayer, but uh, for, for the rebuild, I think the rebuild, uh, we can just kind of do what we want, which actually kind of brings us to the next second. Um, now that now that we kind of finish up this campaign, and now I'm kind of getting back into Trail Makers, I'll probably be doing a lot more build episodes and everything. I know everybody used to love watching me do that stuff, and I actually really enjoyed it. Just needed the time for that. I was looking for those spiked wheels, so uh, yeah, we're probably going to bring that well, more back uh, back to the channel. I don't know, uh, maybe some live streams. Not entirely sure uh, on what I wanted to do specifically with it. All I knew is that I needed to play the new campaign and also try out uh, the new parts because uh, building airplanes was actually kind of hard in this game and make them like really, really function uh, function correctly. 
so um, anyway guys you know what uh, this was kind of like a shorter episode I do apologize for that but I want to thank every uh, everyone for tuning in today here on Command Wolf Gaming hope you enjoyed the footage did you guys know only about 5% of you are actually subscribed to the channel that's right only about 5% of you are actually subscribed to the channel so make sure you hit that big red subscribe button down below also hit that bell notification button to be notified on when I'm updating the channel because I'm trying to update the channel uh, as often as possible if you want to receive those notifications and you got to hit the, uh, that subscribe button but also you can actually tune into our uh, discord channel that's right we do have a discord channel and a link down below for those who are interested and in that discord channel not only will you be joining a wider community of people but you also be able to uh, do uh, join in our uh, community nights right that's right community nights and in those community nights we'll either be playing multiplayer games you know maybe doing some uh, trail maker stuff or uh, scrap mechanic um, and then we'll have movie nights where we can sit down and watch movies together so yeah there's a couple things that I want to do that I have planned I've actually been doing movie nights with it uh, with a couple people so if you want to join me in the movie night that would be fantastic um, also, you will receive notifications on when I am updating my Odyssey and Rumble channel. And not only that, but also Kick as well. Because Kick actually has a streaming service as well. So, yeah. If you want to tune into that stuff, that would be great. Uh, just so you know, um, Rumble and Odyssey will have exclusive content uh, that you will not find here on YouTube. So, if you want to see that exclusive content, make sure to follow me on there. Um also we do have a merchandise store that's right we do have a merchandise store so if you want to help fund the channel and help keep the channel going make sure to check out my merchandise store uh we have long sleeve shirts we got short sleeve shirts we got baseball caps and we also have beanies on here with a variety of colors uh so if you want to pick up your own exclusive command wolf gaming merchandise Make sure to check that uh, down that link down below because it does help fund the channel. If you do want to help fund the channel but not uh, purchase any merchandise, we also have a link for that. There's a tip jar. Anyway, guys, uh, I want to thank you guys for tuning in today here on Command Wolf Gaming. As always, like, subscribe, and share. Spread the love. And I hope to see you next time here on Command Wolf Gaming. Bye-bye now.